With no basketball season this year and 60 degree temperatures in December, we felt a visit to Harry Carey's was in order. We're at Harry Carey's, and who am I with? We're with the first lady of baseball, the grand dame of Harry Carey's restaurant, Dutchie Carey, and welcome to Dining Chicago. Thank you, Dave. It's nice to be here. You. So, tell me what, what happened down there yesterday in St. Louis. Well, it was a wild town, I'll tell you that. It was up for grabs. It was a beautiful, beautiful situation down there. Two teams that really seemed to like each other and congratulating each other. It was a nice, nice thing for them to do. It's a, it's a great thing that's happening to baseball. I mean, this, this excitement, it's really revived. You, can't, you couldn't get a ticket to that country yesterday. No way. It was awful. You couldn't get a ticket for love nor money. A lot of money you could get a ticket for. Now tell me, what, what are you doing at the restaurant? You're here all the time. Tell me what you do here. Well, I come in and I talk to people and they greet me and they recognize me. It's really nice to be here among, I feel like it's my friends. I come down, Grant's always really nice to me. I don't know his... We're talking about that fella. Right. about that fella hiding over there. Take a <laughs> shot over there, fella. That's... Uh, that's... That's, those, are the, those are the watchful eyes. Those are the watchful <laughs> yeah. eyes of Grant Porter, who's the president of Harry Carey's. Yeah. And actually, he always gives me an empty bottle of wine. <laughs> what was it that you told me was your, well, one of your favorite things about Harry Carey's? Of course, it's the steaks. What else? I mean, they are fabulous. Yeah. All right. Well, you've got Think the peppercorn it. steak. Right. Right. And Vesuvio. you have the Vesuvio. Yes. And, um, actually, in a little while, we're going to actually get up, but we're going to watch you do what up there. You're going to lead the. Uh, oh yeah. Oh no. Oh wait. Fine. We got a few minutes. Few minutes. Yeah. Yeah. She's going to lead the national anthem. No. <laughs> Take me out to no, the ball, the game. ball game. All right, all right. I'm a, you know, I can't even sing "Take Me Out to the Ball Game," much less the national anthem. Well, let's have a little bit of food. And, all right. And uh, Dana's here. She's going to throw down some appetizers. And hey, okay, Dana, you've got some broccoli for us. Sauteed mushrooms. Oh, sauteed mushrooms nice. and some spinach. Spinach, sauteed and garlic and olive oil. Thank you very much. Thank you, Dana. And I'm going to pretend like I'm going to cut it, but I want you to make a little sandwich. I am going to cut. No, oh, it's already cut. Because your poor cameraman has been working and working and working. So I am going to make a sandwich for Paula here. Paula. You know, you might be setting a union precedent. I don't know. <laughs> here you go, Paula. <laughs> All right, we're going to dig in, and uh, we're going to see up by the bar in a few minutes.